Hello and welcome to this video where we are going to explain to you how our software works. And if you've seen our other videos, all of what you've seen there all comes together in this one software and can be managed by this exact software. So if we start with the system architecture, our software is a server-based software. So we have our server that sits somewhere and from any computer that's in the same network, you get a nice little GUI and you can operate our software. Um, where this server sits doesn't actually matter. It can be uh, on-premise or it can be in the cloud. Behind this is a Microsoft SQL database and that allows us to run really small systems and up to really large systems. Doesn't matter to us. So anything where you, know, you may have just a couple of doors, this is the right thing. Or if you want to manage up to 40, 50,000 keys uh, with some 30,000 users, that's also not a problem for our software. And the beauty is, it's all in one. So everything we have in our product portfolio comes together in our software. So you can have your doors from your access control system in there. You can have your gates, gate control. Um, all the keys in the key management cabinets. Uh, if you have uh, work equipment or any other assets, for example, uh, radios or hand scanners, anything of that sort. Um, even our tech stack, uh, textile management solution, uh, for example, the uh, textile cabinets and all the rest of the solution, all comes together in this software and is managed centrally. Now, reports, is an essential part of any software today. And we've made our reports uh, really flexible. You can um, focus the report on a specific user if you want to know what somebody did uh, over a period of time, or you can actually focus it maybe on a specific asset if you want to know how much your radio or a specific key is used. Um, or you can, you can you know, uh, focus it on one of our solutions if you want to know how's the usage of my gate control, how many cars go in and out, uh, that type of thing. And yeah, to make it really uh, complete, all this should really happen fully automatic. So we have this workflow module in here, which comes as a standard, and that allows you um, to add logic to all this or automate some of the processes. Um, you can automatically start or stop processes, or you can create clever links where you say, look, um, a user has to return all his keys and all his assets before he can exit the premises through the gate. Um, and all that is just a click away and really easy to set up. Um, and last but not least, we believe the world of today and tomorrow will be more driven towards mobile solutions. So all of this um, can end in our new app that we've developed. So this app is called dice to go and any event that's generated in our software, you can send to an app. And the nice thing about it is um, every user can get different messages about different events. So the admin obviously will get more information or different information than your everyday user, for example. And um, we actually use this in our own building. Um, and we use this um, for, as one example uh, with our proof of visit system, our guard tour control system, because our colleagues here uh, nicely do a control around the guard tour every evening to make sure all the windows um, are closed uh, and the doors are locked. And uh, once that tour is over, they put this into the docking station and the admin gets sent uh, a direct notification in real life um, if the guard tour was completed by 100% or maybe just 80% and then we have to go again and when the guard tour happens and it automatically creates a report and lets me know my mobile device. And um, yeah, how that's done, let me show you. So here we would be at the end of one of our guard tours that we do every evening. And at the end of it, we check that all the doors are locked. So at the moment they're not locked. So what the guard is supposed to do is he's gonna take his data collector, scan the checkpoint and make sure the doors in lock mode. Come in. There we go, locked and my tour is over. So before I can go home as a guard, I'll take my data collector, 
and put it in the docking station. And the administrator will be informed almost in real time about the end of the tour. So we put it in here, it starts to read. And there we go. Me as the administrator is notified directly on my app. Yeah, so I hope I could explain the software a little more to you. And um, if you're interested, please give us a call or get in touch with us. We're here.